Unveiling the Hidden Kingdom, Bhutan explained. Bhutan, the last great Himalayan kingdom, is a fascinating nation with a vibrant culture and jaw-dropping vistas. A landlocked gem, Bhutan is nestled amidst the eastern end of the Himalayas. The country's name in its local language, Tsongkha, is Druk Yul which translates to Land of the Thunder Dragon. This name refers to the fierce storms that often roll in from the Himalayas. Bhutan follows a unique policy of gross national happiness. This philosophy emphasizes spiritual growth and values the well-being of citizens over materialistic progression. This policy truly distinguishes Bhutan from the rest of the world. Bhutan is the world's only carbon-negative country. Its constitution mandates that at least 60% of the nation remains forested for all future generations, making it a green paradise. Timpu, the capital of Bhutan, has no traffic lights. Instead, police officers direct the traffic with carefully choreographed hand movements, enhancing the charm of this quaint city. Bhutan was isolated from the world until the 1960s. The internet and television were only introduced in 1999, making it one of the last countries to adopt these technologies. Bhutan has never been colonized. Throughout history, it has remained an independent nation, guarded by the formidable Himalayan ranges and its robust traditional culture. Bhutan's national animal is the Takin. This peculiar creature is a goat antelope found in the eastern Himalayas. Locals believe the Takin to be created by the divine madman, a popular figure in Bhutanese folklore. Archery is the national sport of Bhutan. Every village has an archery range and competitions, often accompanied by traditional music and dance, form an essential part of local festivities. Traditional music and dance form an essential part of local festivities. Bhutanese cuisine is rich and diverse, heavily influenced by its geography. The national dish is Emma Datcher, a spicy mix of chilies and cheese. The Tiger's Nest Monastery, perched on a cliff 900 meters above the Paro Valley, is one of Bhutan's most iconic landmarks. According to legend, Guru Rinpoche flew to this location on a tigress's back to meditate. Bhutan is a predominantly Buddhist nation. Its rich heritage is reflected in the numerous monasteries, prayer flags, and religious festivals throughout the country. Bhutan uses a unique dual system of government. The spiritual leader is the J.E. Kenpo. While the administrative matters are handled by the Druk Jialpo, the Dragon King. Bhutan is the land of Dzongs, fortress-like monasteries that serve as administrative, military, and spiritual centers. Each Dzong is a work of art, reflecting the country's architectural genius. Bhutan's currency is the Ngultrum, whose value is pegged to the Indian rupee. Interestingly, Indian rupees are also widely accepted throughout the country. Lastly, Bhutan is one of the few countries that measure their success not in gross domestic product, but in gross national happiness, a testament to its commitment towards a holistic and sustainable living. Experience Bhutan, where happiness is a place. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe.